Good morning, everyone. How are you all doing? I'm fantastic. It is actually quite nice out. It's chilly, but it's warm. And we're going to cross the street. Let's go. Let's go. There's other dogs. <laughs> yep. You need to calm down, ma'am. You're stuck behind me. Anyway, as I was saying, now that the dog is passed, my dog's a terrible walker. So, it's race day. So, I've gotten into the habit of every morning taking her around the block. It adds 1,500 to 2,000 steps to my day. And I actually kind of like it. Gets her out for a stroll. Gets me out for a stroll. And, you know, maybe one day she'll stop freaking out on dogs like that. So, I uh, just wanted to show. It's actually quite nice out. I'm uh, pleased with how the weather is so far. We'll see how it is later. <laughs> Alrighty, so here is my breakfast, and I'm also gonna eat an apple with it um, for the carb. And I have my stuff set up here um, to guide me through the run. So I have that stuff like normal. In this, I'll be drinking that through the run. I'm gonna mix this and sip on this for the first probably half hour or so. I'll probably start sipping on that at like maybe quarter after ten actually. Uh, and then I'm going to use this protein today for my post um, nutrition thing only because uh, I was going to use a different one, but apparently one full serving is two packs and it's just not going to be enough protein for what I'm going to do because um, this will technically be my second meal and I'm going to do tortilla with peanut butter and a banana. That is what I'm doing right now. So just making the kids breakfast. Uh, I'm going to eat mine really soon. I'm going to be leaving in just under an hour now. I should probably get my ass in gear. <laughs> All right, good. Good, good. No, why? Oh, my glasses are breaking. I can wear them anyway. It's fine. Okay, so I'm just leaving to go to where... Um, yeah, that's exactly what's happening right now. Uh, to go to where I'm going to do the race. Like I said before, I'm going to follow the actual route. Uh, so in here I have my Havoc pre-workout. I just went to the bathroom. Hopefully because I've not had any coffee I will not be peeing or have to pee very soon because that's a thing. Um, I need to keep sipping on this to make sure that it's in there. Uh, I plan on starting in about half an hour. Now the beta alanine in that is going to drive my face crazy. I've never had an entire packet before. I think I've only ever done like a quarter of a packet. So um, I've used this stuff for Tough Mudders and other stuff. It's strawberry lemonade. It's actually pretty good. It has this like after flavor of fruit that's really good. So I really like it. Um, I'm not nervous, but I'm nervous. Like I want to do really well on this run, but with the winds, I don't know. So I'm going to bring my headphones just in case. I'm probably going to pop this up on my head up top here like this. There we go. So this is from my barbell box. They gave us a buff this uh, this month, which was super cool and it's super cute and I really like it. Um, so it'll help hold everything in. I don't know what this size or anything looks like, so I'll have to look at that after. Um, but yeah, it's super cute. And yeah, I'm probably gonna wear sunglasses because I don't want people to see my eyeballs. So um, wish me luck, everyone. I mean, by the time you see this, it'll already be done. You'll know what's gonna happen probably in the next clip. So. Well, no, maybe I'll do, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what I'm going to do. Oh, I've started. Need a quick walk break. Saw a bunch of other people doing it. It's very exciting. I'm wearing the sweatshirt because it's cold. It's really fucking cold, man. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Guys, oh my God. I ran that in 36.25. That's what Strava says. I think it was like 36.30 or 29 or something like that. Not 36, 39. I ran it under 40 minutes, which I'm super, super, super excited about because I had resigned myself to like, I was like, oh, it's, I'm hoping 40 minutes, but I'm gonna give myself like probably 45, 50 minutes. Mm -mm. I did that shit in under 40, which I, I went into this with no goal. Uh, I did not know what I was going to do. I didn't know where I was going to be. I really wish I had access to a treadmill right now. <sighs> I just really, really want to be able. So the first kilometer I ran without stopping. I think I stopped for like 
five seconds to walk, not stop, but like just to walk. But um, that first kilometer, I, I ran almost straight and I was really happy and I was really glad that I didn't stop. But again, that last kilometer, I was starting to get excited. And then once I hit like the park to come up and around, I got super excited again. And I was like, I need to slow down and calm down because I'm getting super excited. I know the end is in sight, yet I knew I still had like two, three minutes of running because I know what my pace is. So um, <laughs> overall, I am super happy with how that went. And um, shout out to Adam for coming out to cheer me on. That was super sweet um, for you to do that. And who's Adam? Well, he's a friend of mine and that's all the information you're getting. So uh, <laughs> maybe one day I will explain further, but uh, otherwise I'm on my way home. I have not eaten yet. I was not hungry quite yet. I'm starting to get a little bit hungry, so I will eat when I get home. And uh, I, everything's in my bag, which is in the back seat. Otherwise, I'd grab it now. So, um, but yeah, I will eat that. And then um, shower, <coughs> excuse me, relax a little bit. And then I'm going over to Adam's for some dinner because he gets really excited about things and he was super happy with everything. So um, that was cool. But yeah, I'm gonna end this now because I just totally ran out of things to say. <laughs>